Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of the YouTube world, CJ Rose is back in the building. Welcome back to the channel. All right. NXT Great American Bash has come. NXT Great American Bash has finished. Now, I want to I want to touch on something before we begin, right? <clears throat> Don't get me wrong. This was not a terrible show. It wasn't really even a bad show. It was a pretty solid show at best. Pretty solid, right? The the problem that I kind of had with this show was it felt directionless, right? It's like nothing's really set on what's next, right? And I'm talking more for the NXT title, the North American title as well, and the Women's Championship. There's really no directions for those, like... What are we, where are we going? I'll touch base on all three of those championships in these videos, as I as I kind of do now. But I just want to say, it wasn't a bad show. Main event was amazing. That was an amazing main event. We're going to get into the main event. But I don't know. This show just feels like, man, where are we going now? Like They're bringing back No Mercy for September 30th. That's cool, but I guess we'll see where the roads lie, right? Okay, so with that being said, welcome to NXT Great American Bash review. <laughs> Reviews. <laughs> All right, so we kicked off the show. Well, we had a pre-show match. I didn't really watch it, didn't care for it. I just know that uh, Dragon Lee, Nathan Frazier, and whoever... I forgot the other two women in that match. Pardon me. Um, their names, but they got the W. And that was that was that. But we started off the night with the NXT Tag Team Championships on the line, as we had the family, Tony D'Angelo and Stax versus Gallus. And you know what time it is. When Gallus is hit, it can only mean one thing. Wolf gang. Wolf gang. Wolf gang or don't bang. You know what I'm saying? Wolf gang's in the house. You already know what it is, man. So in my, in my predictions, I felt like, I, I felt like we were going to have new champions. It felt like that. Because out of every match that Gallus has had since becoming champions, neither one of those matches gave me a thought of, huh, we might have a new champion. This, however, gave me that thought. Um, Also, with Tony D'Angelo. So I'm like, all right. Let's see what goes down. So matches underway. Pretty standard tag team match for what it is. Um, is it Joko? I get these br I get these coffee brothers confused every single time. They don't look alike. <laughs> I just forget who's who. <laughs> like, like is it Mar was it Mark? Is it Mark that tag that teams with Wolfgang or is it is it Joe? It's Joe, right? It's Joe because Joe. See, ugh. I say Mark. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. <laughs> So Joe Coffey is um, distracting most of the match, and that's getting kind of um, irritating for Stax and Tony D. But again, it was a pretty standard tag team match. You know, in the beginning, team took advantage. Another team came back. Team took advantage. Another team came back. It was pretty, again, it was, it, it was what it was, right? So then... Going towards the end. So, towards the end, um, I think Mark called on his brother. He said, he said something. And then he just, and then Joe just pulls out a, a stick. Like, it has to be something 
Irish. Like it had, this, this, this stick had to be something Irish, right? I don't know what it was, but he just, just whoop, you know, <laughs> that, right? He gets on the apron. He looks like he's about to use it. The referee's distracted. So the ref is handling that. Wolfgang takes the stick. He's like he's about to hit. He's he, he's about to hit stacks with it. The ref takes the stick away. And then here comes Mark. Boom. With a forearm. Then Gallus hits their tag team finishing move, which I I don't even know if that has a name, bro. Does that ma does that move have a name? It might not. I don't think that move got a name. But boom, he hits. Uh, they hit stacks with it. One, two, boom. Tony D able to break it up. And then from there, um, Gallus goes after Tony D. Um, Tony D then able to get an advantage. Got um coffee and a power bomb, and then boom. Both him, both coffee and Wolfgang hit the um steel steps, both of them taken out. So there here comes Joe in the in the um ring. He's about to hit stacks. Joe runs up, stacks ducks. Tony D, boom, hits him with a crowbar. So, you know, they got the crowbar stash. Throws it out. Now, mind you, Gauss is on the outside. Tony D says, Lorenzo, let's do this. Um, whips Lorenzo into an assisted dive. Tony gets back up on the apron. He's like, like yo, like, like stacks. Let's go, let's go, let's go. They rushing because they know what time it is. Lorenzo gets back in the ring with Wolfgang. Tags in Tony D. Hits the bada boom, bada bing. One, two, three. We have new NXT Tag Team Champions. I am exceptionally sad. I am very sad that my man Wolfgang lost. I am I am wholeheartedly sad i am more sad that he took the pin <laughs> i'm sad but i'm happy for tony d this is his first nxt title now one half of the tag team champions i thought tony d would be a little bit more in a different position but either way i'm happy for him man i like tony d my man's a tag team champion the family they about to have a celebration on nxt you watch <laughs> You watch. But now, what's next? I feel like they might have a rematch for these tag team titles. Might be uh, the family versus Gauss again. So you'll probably see that in No Mercy. Even though I don't know, that, I don't know if they're going to hold this. Because that's a month and a half. <laughs> no, that's... Today's July 30th, right? Yeah. No Mercy September. That's a two month... That, no, you're not building that for two months. <laughs> you're not, you ain't going gonna to keep this fresh for two months. I, I don't think so. So we'll probably see a new team on the scene. Probably get probably get the tag titles. It's all good. Good way to start it off. Crowd was on. Crowd was hot. Crowd was feeling it. Hey, good way to start it. All right, next match. Let's get it.